Jamaica. So my daddy, I love. So my friends, I love. Tell Dina she can't have my bags. again with another travel vlog um so i'm in haiti <laughs> um y'all i'm home period like my real home mm. um i flew in yesterday i left two days ago i had overnight in fort lauderdale um did not enjoy that <laughs> um and y'all, while when I was on my way to the airport, I got my period. I got my freaking period. And if you're a gem, if you've been here, okay, listen, y'all know my period. One thing about my period, she wanna take me out the game. I was so upset because she's a whole week early. Like I anticipated her being a little early. I said, let me, you know, bring some things with me just in case. Um, she comes a few days early. But at least I know for a fact I had the, the beginning of the trip to really enjoy. Man. <laughs> I wanted to... <sighs> Y'all, like, I wanted to lose my shit. Like, <laughs> I really did. Um, so, yeah, so finally got in yesterday. And I have basically been either eating or laid out in a bed dead um since i've been here <laughs> so i essentially wasted two days so this is the second day that i've been here and it's 8 40 and i'm just now getting ready to go out to, like actually go out <sighs> so it's been it's been interesting um i just took some more ibuprofen so that'll hold me over until like around 11 ish when i need to re-up again but hopefully by then we'll be settled in at a restaurant or something um and ready to go y'all that period done took me out, child. Took me out the game. I should start getting ready sooner. Like, I have no excuse for running late right now. No excuse at all. Um, but we came. Um, I had my first meal here at the hotel. 
and it was so good i ordered grilled goat with rice de coulis de riz national which is rice and in, in, in peas um it came with like a little carrot side salad situation and fried plantains y'all that goat i said i'm home i'm home okay um and this morning i had breakfast and i had my moulin hello to my my moulin uh which is cornmeal cornmeal but y'all uh, i'm gonna do a whole what i eat in a day haiti edition because like Haitian food is just top tier. Haitian food is so good, but it's so laborious. And that's why I I don't be cooking it like that. When I say like that, when I say like that, I mean like ever. Cause it's just, it's so much work. Y'all, I should be doing my makeup. So I'm here with my friend and her husband, my friend from high school. Uh, shout out to Rachelia, if you're watching this. Um, she actually started her own channel and I've been like reposting it on my community tab because her channel is Chef's Kiss. She actually moved to Haiti. I think she was done with school in the states and um has been well has been living her best life here ever since and i just love watching her document her journey here in haiti because i feel like she's showing a side to haiti that nobody ever shows like in the media all you ever hear is natural disaster and third world country poverty that's all you ever hear about haiti that's all you ever hear about a lot of countries that you know they don't want you to really hear about um so i'm glad that she is committed to her channel and so far her vlogs have been amazing and she's vlogging this trip as well so it's giving point of view now like i said i basically uh lost two days because of my period um so her vlog would definitely have more to show than mine will um very sad for me but definitely happy that you guys also have a second vlog to check out to get a better perspective of this trip but anyways I'm gonna throw in a quick little beat. Actually, I'm about to really do like something quick, 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 quick. But I kind of want to do like something, very much something. I don't know what I want to do yet. All right. Actually, let me just do a quick something because I should already be done and putting on the final touches. <laughs> so um, yeah, it's it's definitely been a vibe. It's been a vibe yeah i'm just gonna do my concealer look which should be fine since i'm losing what, what little tan i had left because this used to be so bright on me and now it's like my skin shaking at this point i'm sorry if you guys hear like background noise but like i'm right under the tv system and it makes noise and just like the air and all that stuff i'm sure that's gonna make noise as well um, so I apologize for that in advance. You'll probably be hearing a lot of it while I'm here. Um, but yeah, y'all, I'm so excited to be here. Like, y'all have no idea. For the longest time, like, I just, I couldn't come. I, for one, my job wouldn't let me. Um, so now that I am self-employed, we thank God. I don't really have those restri restrictions, restrictions anymore. So love that for me. And I fully plan on taking advantage of it. Y'all, is Cuba still shut, shut, not shut down, but are we still allowed to go to Cuba? Because I wish I was still working at my job then. <gasps> not me dipping my mirror in the powder, child. I was still working at my job then, so while technically anybody could go to Cuba, I still couldn't go. So I never got to experience it. Um, but Kim went and she said, I think she said she enjoyed it. I want to have like a content trip, like legit go somewhere and just focus on getting content. I thought like that would be really nice for my Instagram feed. Um, so it's something I'm thinking about. I wish there was like, I had like a group of content creators that we were all like cool and stuff and we could just take a trip together and help each other, you know, take all that content. So I feel like that would be really helpful and ideal, but dreams darling dreams but yeah about to throw on this quick beat um i'm gonna use oh no i didn't bring it darn it i bought um a huda beauty bronzer during the sephora sale but i didn't bring it with me oh because i just have my same makeup that i've been traveling with 
and I didn't really change out anything new. Oh, I'm so upset about it. Oh, man. Y'all. Oh, no, that bouncer could have been a vibe. I'm not going to know if I get back home. But, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to finish getting ready. And then we will be out the dough. Out of the dough. <laughs> I know I'm always on a time crunch. <laughs> I'm always on a time crunch. Maybe one thing about me, things to go, people to see. Okay, things to go, places to go, <laughs> and people to see. You know what? That's my cue to turn off this camera, finish this face, and head out. Because I don't know what the heck I'm saying at this point. <laughs> But yeah, I'm so excited to be here. You guys have no idea. I hope you guys really enjoy this vlog. It's so important to me to show you guys Haiti, like real Haiti. The Haiti that you don't see in the media. Like, just show y'all Haiti. Show y'all my culture, my heritage, where my peoples came from, my family came from, my parents came from, um, my roots. I, I ain't got a root, period. Um, apparently my beard, because I didn't even shave that. I couldn't even do my normal prep before I left, y'all. <laughs> yeah, your girl be struggling, like, struggling. I don't know what I just did. I feel like my makeup not gonna hit tonight, because I don't know what I just did just now. Anyway, let me go. So I can focus, y'all. <laughs> I'll see y'all later. Okay, so the face is pretty much done. Um, a little bit of a concealer, powder, contour, a little blush, no highlight, no foundation. My brows are looking a little thick, um, but that's all right. And I'm using Taja's Gloss in Classic Nude, which you guys know I've been loving her glosses. Um, so yeah, I need to moisturize my scalp because that thing, that thing dry, okay? Dry, dry. Um, so I forgot my moisture, well, I didn't forget. I intentionally took it out because I had no space. So I'm just gonna moisturize my hair with some of this Nexus Humectris Conditioner. And it's not working out that great. <laughs> um, as a conditioner, it's great, but I definitely should have um, brought my moisturizer. But baby, let me tell you, between the, the scalp dryness and then messing with my scalp and then bleaching it, which of course leads to chemical burn. Yeah, I really be playing with my whole life, like, and I really need to stop. But will I? No. No. I meant to switch out my oil because y'all know this is like my and I still have a little more than a third left my Tom Ford Soleil Blanc I have been abusing this since last summer or spring like whenever I'm showing any kind of body yaddy yaddy skin baby I'm gonna have that oil on okay um, but I meant to switch it out for the NARS Manoy oil because um, I had recently purchased that one and I haven't tried it out yet on the skin and I meant to like really like take it for a spin this trip. Completely forgot, y'all. <sighs> Completely forgot. But such is life. Um, anyways, yeah, so where's my fragrance for tonight? Ready for tonight. Oh I went to Bath and Body Works and I bought like a little mini travel size spray for like when I'm going to the beach and stuff. Because I don't necessarily want to wear perfume. I still want to smell good and I feel like this is the epitome of beach vibes. It's called Bahamas Passion Fruit and Banana Flower. Ironically, I really like how the banana in it pulls everything together. And I'm not a banana flavor or smell or anything kind of person. So I'm very surprised that that's what I like about it. Um, <sighs> so there's no Fenty butter in this. There's like this much butter left. And I just put my EOS lotion in here because I didn't have time to open up my refill that I got from Sephora of the actual Fenty to put it in here so I'm about to mix this up with my um, baby oil because the EOS lotion it's very moisturizing like very moisturizing it's gonna be soft but it has no sheen no shine no nothing like and I have naturally very dull skin so that's why I like products that kind of like enhance or brighten or you know just make my skin look glossy so i'm gonna mix it with some oil because baby while it gives you moisture it does not give you any shine at all no nothing like your skin looks just as dehydrated as it did before you put the lotion on but feels 10 times better <laughs> it's a love-hate relationship for me uh mainly love though so i can just put a little oil in there you know we 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 on the love i'm gonna say it's a love relationship i'll take that back 
my usual O'Keefe's on the crusty feet because I'm what? Born crusty. Y'all know what it is already. Y'all know the spiel. Um, yeah. What's that? Did I even bring my baccarat? Yeah, I did. My ambery saffron. Not sponsored. Uh, it's this number from Kirby Sense. You guys saw the haul, but this is how it looks like on the body. Like, for real, on the body. And I paired it with these earrings. I feel like these are from Nevea. Not Nevea. Um, what's that brand called? Darn it. Everything that I can find, I will link down below for you guys. Where did I get this from? The lifestyle? Maybe it's from the lifestyle. I'm not sure, but I'll look for it and I'll link it down below. If I can't find it, I'll find a similar one and link it down below. So Curvis and Stress. Lives. I don't know earrings. <laughs> um, I don't really bring jewelry with me on this trip. I just brought these earrings. I bought a ring. Where's my ring? Actually, I'm gonna put that on because, like, since how you not gonna bring jewelry and the one that you did bring, you're not gonna wear? Like, the math ain't math. What happened? My where I put it at? Where did I put it at? Oh my god. Period. And sandals are from Shein. Are they from Shein? Oh, yeah, they are. I just got like these gold woven sandals super cute and i felt like a great way to be comfortable but still dress up in outfit oh that was loud <laughs> but yeah so this is the look Closed and running breakfast to meet with Chili and Sammy. Um, after that, I'm gonna come back, change my clothes. Actually, yeah, come back, change my clothes, and then we're gonna go on a tour of the Ciudad Um, it's basically like this fortress that they built really high in the mountains so that they can like watch out for invaders or something like that in the corner. So. That'll be really interesting and it's different for me. I actually really don't like things like that, but I gotta do it one time for one time. In my country, in my home, in my house. So, I'm gonna take that with you for sure. All right, I'm gonna brush my teeth, but what's going on right now? Give. Let me show you guys a view from my room, and then when I go to breakfast, I'll show you the view from the breakfast room. Uh, hello, 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 Haiti, hello, Capaisien. Like, yes, 
Ugh. I stand. Absolutely gorgeous. Can you believe I haven't been in that water yet? Can you believe I have not yet been in that water? Or this water? And if anybody knows anything about me, the first thing I do when I come to the trip, put that bathing suit on and frolic in the water, okay? Oh my God. I woke up with the meanest cramps. <laughs> you know, woman is trash. Like, trash. I hate it for me. I really do. I hate it for me. But, anyways, let me go change so I can take out with me to breakfast. Breakfast. I don't know what I'm gonna wear. I need to just throw something on. Put your one hand up. Put your booty on the floor. Put your one hand up. Put your booty on the floor. Put your one hand up. Put your booty on the floor. Put your booty on the floor. And I got back up. Period, baby. Period, baby. This is really random. But I just want to say that I think air just goes so well with my skin. Like... My skin is always just so luscious when I'm on an island. I just, I feel like <laughs> my skin is trying to tell me something. My skin is trying to tell me maybe the states are not my home. Like, the, maybe, just maybe, it's not meant to be. <laughs> you know? <laughs> like, I don't know. I'm just a messenger, okay? I don't make the rules. I don't. I'm not choosing the island life. The island life is choosing me. Like, this is not a, mis a decision I'm taking for myself. You, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just feel like that's what I'm being told to do. My skin is telling me that I just need to be living on somebody's island. You know, and I just, I'm a rule follower, you know? I follow rules. Sweet Lord. Okay? I just gotta do what my body's telling me to do, honey. Yeah. Ooh. Well, these cramps will take me out. Oh, all right, y'all. <sighs> Gotta go to breakfast. Whew, if I make it there, God dang. So we're getting ready to head to the Citadel tour, um, but we're also switching rooms. So we can go to um, a room with the balcony further up on the fifth floor. So I'm super excited about that. So we're like changing, but also like packing up our things. Um, so that as soon as we come back, we just switch hotel rooms. So I gotta repack. So I gotta. Perk something in eight. Ay, ay, ay. So <laughs> everywhere I go, I can't go horseback riding because I'm too big, right? But they said that it's not gonna be a problem here. <laughs> And I'm like, um, oh, horses' lives matter. Like, do we really want to make a horse suffer? <sighs> Carrying this body, yada, 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 yada. Um, so I don't know. I guess I'll assess the situation when I get there. I'm just like, dang, like, what, what, what do y'all horses go through that they can carry me that other countries cannot? Like, what? <laughs> Oh, what's going on? It's not like the states where the animals are pumped with hormones and, and steroids and all that stuff. Like, these are all natural, okay? Baby. <laughs> well, apparently, girl, the animals here be carrying around like cement and stuff, so they just might be able to. Not the animals weightlifting. Bort. Alright. Well, I forgot to show you guys a view at breakfast, so. This is a better view because we're actually outside. <sighs> Are you dying? Because I'm dying. I'm gagging. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna take my horse to the old town road. I'm gonna ride till I can't no more. I'm gonna take my horse to the old town road. I'm gonna ride till I can't no more. I got the horses in the back. Horse stock is attached. Daddy's mad in black. Got the bushes black and mad. Riding on a horse, you can whip your horse. I've been in a valley, you ain't been up off that porch. Ain't nobody tell me nothing. Riding on the track, 
need all in my face. She need all my face. You can go and ask. My life is a movie. Go ride in the blue. Cowboy hat from Gucci. Frank her on my booty. Can't nobody tell me nothing. Just like it's Friday Oh, your body is my party Tonight a private party It's not my birthday But I just want a piece of cake Baby, when you write it, write it You can go slow on my body, body Take control, I know you freak it, freak it Tonight I'ma give it all to you To you I want it less to wait I'ma let you ride it like a pony, lonely Late night call cause you aren't it Oh, she just wanna make love Let my mind come on, sir I saw I've got them from now and mess up Oh, baby, I'm gonna stop with you, hey, till I It be easy for sir Oh, I'm about to yeah. by me uh this life ain't for me <laughs> we just tried to walk to see that day and i i couldn't make it y'all i didn't even get a quarter of the way because it was mostly uphill and like these hills are steep so it's like steep uphill y'all look at sis go watch her vlog because that's how you're gonna see real haiti because apparently <laughs> this vlog you're just gonna see me and i'm okay with that so go watch her vlog if y'all want to actually see details because baby <laughs> You ain't gonna get it here at all. It's about to rain, Lord. Dedication. We love to see it. We love to see it.
ça c'est que école pour jeunes filles, école pour jeunes garçons, qui mm -hmm. est pas ça. Puis là, ça regarde en bas, c'est Arsenal. Comme ça, ça veut dire Arsenal. Mm -hmm. C'est la Zamiote. Ça veut dire Arsenal. Oh, ok, ok, je me connais. Ça veut dire Arsenal, c'est après la mort de Sof. Nous venons habiter dans toute partie ça. Ok. Donc, nous avons jardin avec Piscine. switch our room to the fifth floor of the balcony so here's the bathroom the shower hey your hat <laughs> okay um full length mirror put the closet and i'm touching stuff before i write anything down no bueno and it's just real simple TV, vanity desk area, mini fridge, bed, and most importantly, what? Hello, where's um? Okay, okay, balcony. So we don't have um, which one call it? I had the pool view before. So this is what it's looking like now. Alright, I am starving, so I am um, gonna wipe everything down and go eat. <laughs> like, um, I'm not doing anything else because I am starving. I haven't had anything to eat since breakfast, and it is now 4 30. We had breakfast at 9. We had breakfast pretty late though, so it's not that bad, but. It's bad enough. Like I'm starving. Like Marvin, I'm starving. Like my y'all, I almost had a whole panic attack. Like I, who, I'm just so embarrassed. Y'all just pointing that damn see that there? That was not it. <laughs> that was not what it. Okay. Um, very different. And I was like, you know what? I was right for not going hiking all those times. My friend was going, my friends um, used to go like hiking all the time with a pandemic. And I was like, you know what? The way my knees are set up, <laughs> the way my life is set up, I can't, it's not for me, you know? Like, I like the sound of it in theory, but um, it's just, uh, it's not for me. And today confirmed that. <laughs> And then it was just like the fact that um, all the people there, like they're like guys there like to be tour guides or like rent out like cam not camels, but horses to ride up there. First of all, I'm not getting on no damn horse. As much as I would love to, <laughs> don't make baby horses. I am not putting this big body bands on that poor horse. Like, <laughs> um, but yeah, it was, it was just like, so I knew it was gonna be like a hike. I knew it was gonna be lengthy, but based on the picture that I saw, I thought it would be like a slight incline that would just keep increasing. But it was like a severe incline that was never ending. <laughs> I was like, oh, and it said it's like 45 minutes by foot. I said, 45 minutes of this? Baby, no. <laughs> baby, 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 baby. No, I cannot, child. And so I was over there like, oh my God, I'm already like embarrassed because I can't make the trip. And then I'm over here breathing hard as hell, trying to catch my breath, um, having to stop and stuff. And then the, the man is just there. And I'm like, they're just like watching. <laughs> and now I'm like embarrassed times 10 because one thing about me, like if I'm gonna struggle, let me struggle with myself in private. I don't want to be seen struggling. And so, and I'm a crybaby, so I'm trying to hold back like, <laughs> 
because I don't want them to see me struggle and I'm like it just it was just it was just too much it was too much for for me personally I just I couldn't and I felt bad because the only reason why they really want to go was because of me because they've been there several times so if you're going for me and I can't even make it and I completely lost all interest in going after that I was just like oh my god like I felt so bad y'all I'm not gonna lie I was I was highly ashamed more more I mean, we still went to go see like the palace and the church and all that stuff, so that was cool, which is what you guys saw, but nah, I was very embarrassed, like, I was like, and this is the reason why, Jamima, you don't need to be slacking when it comes to the gym, like, and that just lift the weights either, get on a damn Stairmaster, go back to, you know, running steps like you used to, that's what I need to do weak ass legs y'all and i haven't been i haven't been regular at the gym since jamaica like honestly like i don't know what kind of easy life i was living in jamaica but child i like i've been struggling to snap out of it but um you know, like child yeah so that was my struggle and um i'm embarrassed my natural instinct is to cry and I didn't want to do that because crying would just embarrass me even more. So I just felt like my breathing was getting real labored and it wasn't even from the, the incline because I was I stopped to catch my breath and I was getting labored and I could feel like that, that wheeze in my throat. I was like, baby, if I have a, a, a whole panic attack right now, oh my gosh, it's going to be so embarrassing. So embarrassing, though. Luckily, it didn't get that bad. <laughs> um. So yeah, I, I'm... I'm good off all of that. <laughs> I am good off of all of that, okay? <sighs> Anyways, let me finish wiping down this room. I'm gonna see y'all later. <laughs> So I just had dinner. Um, I'm about to hop in the shower and have a nice scalding hat hat scalding hot shower brush my teeth and die in my bed like literally die so tired I'm absolutely tired um I'm sleepy I'm full and I was drinking. I had a whole couple of drinks. The bartender made me something. I don't know what it was, but it was good. And um, <clears throat> I haven't really been drinking much because I didn't want to mix alcohol with ibuprofen. Because <laughs> learn the hard way. Don't do that. <laughs> it's giving hallucinations <laughs> in the middle of the street. <laughs> Not funny, actually. But um, yeah, so. Have me a little drinky drink, made me sleepy sleepy, and now I'm about to shower shower and then back to sleepy sleepy. <laughs> but can we just get into I love this sports ball from Athletics. Um, Alright y'all, it's been real. I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow. <laughs> Good morning gems. Um I'm currently getting ready for today's activities. Jacob's, I think like island hopping. I'm actually not sure of the details. <laughs> but I, knew, dude, I do know that we're going to the beach. We're going to be on a boat at some point. And that's pretty much the extent of my knowledge. <laughs> I'm super ashy, so don't mind me. I am rushing because the, the driver guide person is here earlier than planned. And I haven't even had breakfast yet. So everyone else did. So I gotta get my life together, child. Oh my god, I don't think I introduced what you're gonna send to the channel. Oh my Okay, I hope y'all have time to do that today. But yeah, so <sighs> trying to hurry up. Um so we get the road, because I'm not leaving here by breakfast, okay? Listen, one thing about me, I'm not gonna start. <laughs> no sir. No, sir. My actual body is 
disgustingly ashy. Um, and I think I'm gonna wait till my sunscreen because I'm running low. So I'm gonna wait till I'm like four out in the sun. So I slather it on. Yeah, looking forward to today's age with Chile's birthday. Super excited about that. Um, yeah, I think today's gonna be a good day. Um, I'm hoping it is. <sighs> yeah. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Alright, y'all. Let me get my life together. Pack up my things. Um, shoot, it's 9 o'clock. I haven't had breakfast. I'm gonna be over pollution on my feet and my yeezys gonna spill out, so I'm gonna turn the camera off. I'll see y'all outside. <laughs> Like I just, I, I, I deserve. <laughs> oh, Kool-Aid. Ain't that the fish that eat crabs? What the? Oh, his thing is blocking it. Bye, <laughs> 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 
<laughs> like, well, I'm glad to say I don't hear the difference, but it has to be really dramatic for me to hear. Like, my, my dad's family, like, that's not from Gwinnite. I don't know if they're all from Gwinnite, though. Well, I'm, I don't know. None of my dad's from Gwinnite, but maybe they're not, but their accent is, like, it's heavy, like. Yeah, I'm cross fingers could never. It's a real workout. Chanel, I'm going to Chanel. Some ball I'm living with you. Oh, true. Wow. Where's the cell phone tower? <laughs> Look at that crab's right there. Oh, oh, like oh, that. Bottle? Bottle? Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> I <lost> it. <laughs> Right there in the middle of the ocean where it's like lighter, it's apparently like a patch of sand underneath the water where you can actually like maybe stand up in it. And I'm like, what is that doing in the middle of the ocean? But I always wonder like what makes the water so patchy. But okay, so between like the reefs and the sand, all that stuff. Um, that's how you know the water is clear, baby. When you can see all that stuff beneath from the top. Okay, real beach water, baby. Now I have the state water. I don't know what that is that we have over in Baltimore, baby. That, that Chesapeake. I don't know, that sand is freely. What is that? I don't know, baby, because you can't see nothing underneath the water, baby. It's giving pollution. It's giving uh, a mesothelioma. Like, I don't, I don't know. This is why I need to be here. I need to live here. This should be my home. Okay, period. <laughs> okay, period. <laughs>
So we're getting ready to head. Are we going home or to the second location? God bless. Wherever that's at. <laughs>
Mm. Uh, not the boat running out of gas. She's vlogging, talking about it's so beautiful. How we getting back home? What? How we getting back home? Who's gonna roll, roll, roll your boat? <laughs> That's not my, my mystery. <laughs> Child, who, who finna row? Row, row, row your boat. Who is gonna be rowing to me? He's gonna find a guy. <laughs> That's our <not> trip. <laughs> That's <all alive. laughs> okay, babe. Okay, that way, that way, So we're swimming in the beautiful beach, and now we are on the way back home. Y'all, it was such a vibe, y'all. Such a freaking vibe. Wow. It's time to go. It's so beautiful. Isn't it cool? I'm that photo. Hmm. Can you see the left NBA? Wow. A nice golden hour picture. So I am back from the beach, took a shower, got dressed, and we're getting ready to go out for dinner. And I'm finally wearing my curve haul dress, baby, because listen, long overdue, okay? Long mother freaking overdue, y'all. I've been wanting to wear this dress for so long. And I'm not even wearing it how I really want to wear it, which is like really dressy, some cute heels and all that stuff. Um, but it's just what I have to do, okay? Bring it with my she and sandals um this one is more dressy like little gold sandals um as opposed to my black fake hermes ones um even though i'm wearing my little nasty coach bag i mean it's not nasty but it doesn't go with the outfit at all and the hermes sandals would actually tie this in better but i don't know the sandals was just it's more rather that so actually let me go see because <laughs> i don't know what i want to do yet like, maybe i should wear these instead let me see how stupid i look with this shoe these sandals in this bag. Let me do one shiny gold and one black. <laughs> the black is gonna tone it down, but it'll go better with the bag. No, I gotta do the gold. <laughs> like, why would I tone it down even more? Immediately, no. Immediately, no. I am starving. I didn't eat that much um, at the beach because the ocean was real rocky as y'all saw and i didn't want to have too much food in my stomach in case you know i got seasick which thankfully i did not so all right i'm ready to head out about to hit up Archilia, see if she's ready yet and hopefully stuff my face with some good food tonight we gonna see we gonna see look at the birthday girl look at the birthday girl yes I love it. So I never introduced Rachelia. <laughs> hey y'all. You wanna talk about your channel? Shameless yes, plug. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so y'all, it's Rudy B. And it's basically a, a channel that shows what it's like to live in Haiti. Mm -hmm. um, the real Haiti, not just what y'all see on the news. Right. Like that. So, it's a little different. Go and check it out, Rudy B. Yes, definitely go check it out. <laughs> That's R U T T Y and then B. Period. I'm gonna plug it in so they can see. <laughs> okay. Sammy, you wanna give you a little spiel? Hey, what's up? What's up, Jen? Yes. Oh. Jen, Jen, Jen. Her people's name is Jen. Yeah, I'm a producer. I have a YouTube channel, so you can check it out. So. Period. Yeah. Side note, my intro is actually Sammy's beat. Yeah, I did it. So. Yes. <laughs> and you've been telling me I need to switch it up. Yeah, I I'm going to give you another one. <laughs> <laughs> I really like the 
intro. And we're chilling. I mean, I <laughs> Yeah. Come on, friend. Yeah. Her cake. Oh, my. It's so pretty. It's huge, though. It's pretty. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I love this. It says Haitian cake? Mm -hmm. Yes. I love it. So, I actually know Rachelia from um, school. school. Yes. <sighs> Back in the day. I'm back in the side. Eat the cake, anime. Eat the cake, anime. Hold on, I'm nice. Bring this piece. Oh, this is a huge cake. That's a big cake. How are we going to bring this to the restaurant? What's your family talking about? Maybe I should. Um, no. Okay. My love is very special. If you want it, you can have it. But don't take me for granted. So much, so much, so much things I did not say. I'm from Portmore, that's in Tay. Hey, we can do it on that. Bitch, I'm turned. <laughs> oh my god, I love this dress, but I also hate this dress. Oh my god, I can barely walk. <laughs> but damn, I look good in it though. I didn't even take a picture. <gasps> this thing about to be dry as hell. Y'all, I have turned down every opportunity to take a picture today. Not even today, this whole trip. I hate taking pictures. Yo, that bubble cool? That motherfucking Haitian rum, bitch. <laughs> oh my god. That shower after you turn, bruh. Boo, tomatoes, tomatoes, throwing tomatoes. <laughs> oh my god. No, it's gonna get turned for real is if I don't eat. So not like eating too much during lunch and then during dinner I only had a couple fries and I had some of the glue. But y'all like I don't know. I I've been maxed out on fried foods. Like I love Asian food. But some of it I'm like listen. But I mean it's also I'm on this picking it. <laughs> but the restaurant didn't have what I wanted, which was like a roasted chicken thigh. With rice, like I just wanted like something like cooked over fire or like rice, like carbs, like but, like good carbs. I mean, rice isn't really good carbs unless it's like brown rice, and they don't really need like, brown rice. But uh, I'm just like fried foods. I'm over it. Like food thighs, I might enjoy once in a while, but not every day. Like not every day. That's what got be good. Oh my god, like it tastes good, but like I don't do so much fried foods before I start feeling like gross. Right now I'm feeling gross. Well, I mean I'm feeling good. <laughs> but I'm feeling gross. No, I'm back about to die. What the hell? Okay, I'm about to go to sleep. Happy birthday to motherfucker Richelia. Oh my god. Since freaking high school. I love that. I love that. Twenty motherfucking twenty two, graduate two thousand nine, and we're still friends. Love that for me. Love that for her, cause bitch, I'm Bobby. <laughs> I should probably drink water, right? I have my electrolytes and I have bottled water here, so maybe I put my electrolytes in one of these. Cause maybe <laughs> turn down for what, dude? Oh shh! I gotta wake up early to take a picture. I'm gonna take a picture with the sun rising. That's gonna be like what six? Seven, bitch, we gonna wake up at six. I have to wake up before just to do my comb to my makeup. That's dead. <laughs> That's dead. 
dead. Okay, I need to go take a shower. I don't know what's happening right now. I probably should have ate all of my food with all the drinking that we did. But um, I didn't. Oh, I still have my salad. I'm gonna eat my salad. And what put the TV on? Wait a minute, what's on now? What kind of, I'm not be upside down. My fucking good time, bitch. All right, y'all. Good night. <laughs> I'm eating a salad. <laughs> good night. Don't mind me. I'm a little lit, but I didn't even want this. I just wanted to cancel this because I was about to go down to the pool after I went to the beach. But we ended up having to get ready to go out for dinner. So I told him to cancel it, but the guy was like, oh, it's ready. Are you ready? ready. So. <laughs> The like guy said the server, the bartender said it was already ready. It was already ready. So he was just gonna get it from me. All right, you know what? He said it was already ready, so I went ahead and he said pack it up for me to go and I'll have it after. So that's why I wasn't really tripping about finishing all my food today because I know I had a salad. That dressing they use is so freaking bomb. Interrupting my video. Wait, what? Oh my god. It's a dressing. Could they use nothing but iceberg lettuce? I thought like it's a homemade dressing. Like, they can't be. No, they make this. Probably like a little lemon, a little olive oil, the herb mix. But it's so good. I'm really a fan. I keep ordering this salad. Mm. Tonight was a good ass night. Shout out to Virgilio. Happy birthday, boo. I'm drinking, but you been hungry all day. It's the only way I ever feel lit. I don't like, should I stop eating? Like, I feel like that's what the world is telling me stop eating and <laughs> you'll enjoy more out of life <laughs> that is so good mm. I'm just a major editing in this video because who about to post on the internet <laughs> not me food is so good like Why? Why are we just good? Like, even the salad, this dressing. I'm trying to think, like, what's so special about this dressing that I love this salad so much? I don't know. Because I can tell it's a simple dressing. But it's just like the herb mix that they use and put in it. I told them to cancel the answer. <laughs> I told them to cancel the order. But I'm so glad he didn't. He was really just trying to find an excuse to talk to me. He didn't slip. I'm so glad he did, though. They weren't crushing the salad right now. Mmm. I'll have my moment tomorrow. Yeah, my moment the first day. Soup the next day. There's a blend between like soup jumu and bouillon. I don't really know what it was, but crush. Maybe jodian, spaghetti. Spaghetti I see. A chicken. Tomorrow's a surprise. What's your breakfast tomorrow? I don't know. Mm. Uh oh, I'm dumb. <laughs> okay, I'll just decide. There we go. Been real. This shot is so good. Oh my god. 
Look at that. I put it back in the fridge because I wanted to attract ants. All right, let me go take a shower. <laughs> Bye, y'all. <laughs> so, as you guys can see, I am packing my bags, but this is actually not the next day. So, after my little lit rant <laughs> from that night, Richelle's birthday, um, yeah, that Baba Goo I was praising, yeah, uh, your girl was sick. <laughs> your girl was gone, okay, RIP. Um, listen, things. It wasn't a good day, okay? So that last full day that we had, um, I spent the whole day in the room, dying, um, drinking tea, trying to hold down soup. Y'all, like, <laughs> this trip was a hot mess. Like, I was so happy to be in Haiti and stuff, but like, three whole days of me dying in the, in the bed. Like, did I go to Haiti or did I go to my hotel room? <laughs> But yeah, so even by the time you guys are watching like me packing my stuff right now, I still was not a human. I still was not a person. I'm surprised I was able to move so much. Y'all like I'm editing right now and I still do not feel 100%. Like my body, like I'm just too old for this. <laughs> I'm too old for this. My body is rejecting alcohol and you know what? It is what it is. Shout out to Amazon for this uh, luggage weight situation. I am obsessed with it. I just got it. I'm gonna detail it in my next Amazon's favorite video because it's game changer. But yeah, y'all, I was barely able to make it out of Haiti. So thank y'all anyways for watching this vlog, y'all. It's been real. I'm gonna see y'all in the next one though. Toodles. Toodles <laughs> are